everyone, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix the issue where your Rockstar Games launcher isn't opening or working on your PC. If you've been having trouble getting it to load, stick around because I've got several fixes that should do the trick. Let's get started. First, open your start menu and search for Windows Security. Click on it, then head over to Virus and Threat Protection. Scroll down to Virus and Threat Protection Settings and click on Manage Settings. Now, scroll to the bottom until you see Exclusions and click on Add or Remove Exclusions. Next, click Add an Exclusion and choose Folder. Navigate to your Rockstar Games folder. This is usually found on your C drive under Program Files x86. Scroll until you find the Rockstar Games folder. Select it and click Select Folder. Close the window and check if the launcher now opens. If it's still not working, open File Explorer and go to your C drive, then Program Files x86. Find the Rockstar Games folder, right-click it and rename it by adding an underscore at the beginning. Press Enter. If a security message pops up, just click Continue. Then go to your desktop, right-click the Rockstar Games Launcher icon and select Run as Administrator. Give it a few seconds to load. Another thing you can try is to check for any conflicting apps. Open the Start menu, search for Settings and click it. Then go to Apps and click on Installed Apps. In the search box, type OneDrive. If you see Microsoft OneDrive and you don't actually use it, click on the three dots next to it and select Uninstall. OneDrive can sometimes cause compatibility issues with the Rockstar Launcher. Once it's uninstalled, try launching the launcher again. If none of these steps work, update your graphics drivers as a final fix. Open Device Manager by searching for it in the Start menu. Expand Display Adapters, find your graphics card, right-click it and choose Update Driver. Select Search automatically for drivers and let Windows update your driver. Once updated, restart your computer. And that's it, guys. After following these steps, your Rockstar Games launcher should now work properly. If this video helped, drop a like, subscribe for more tech tips and let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.